Hey, my name is Jack Jansen. I am a student at UW-Madison. Uh, today I'm here with Scott Wiener. He's the president and chairman of Capital Brewery. Um, we're going to be talking about Capital Brewery's uh, sustainability efforts. So what is Capital Brewery's philosophy on sustainability and the environment? In the last five, six years, we've, we've migrated and matured more as a company to become more aware of these uh, things because it makes sense. It's good for the environment. It's good for the business. It's good for people. It's good for everything. And this is why we do it. Um, we've been recycling cups and cardboard for a long time. And it wasn't until about five, five years ago when we actually started to look at cons energy consumption, water consumption, things like that, and start to put numbers on it and say, it makes sense to insulate, it makes sense to increase efficiencies, it makes sense to do these things because the economic payback is, uh, is reasonable. Can you describe and show us uh, some of the different measures you've taken around the brewery? Sure, I'd be happy to. Behind each other's back. It also uses a lot less water than our oil because it's much more efficient in the cleaning uh, uh, process and uh, uses less energy, obviously because we're using less hot water. Uh, and uh, so all in all, it's, it's, this is typically, and it requires less people, less time. It's just one of those cost savings where everything, all the numbers work in the right direction. So the payback on this is less than three years. Try to buy as much local as possible. Um, not only is it great product and gives us our, our unique characteristics, but it's local, so there's less energy involved in, in, in shipping. Uh, the money stays in the state. And the stammer. Strange thing. One of the things that it leaves behind are a lot of these, what's called spent grain, primarily uh, uh, the husks of the grain. And those are right in here. And we actually, there's still some nutritional value in them. Uh, you can use them for baking. Uh, and what we do primarily is give them to a local farmer who feeds them to the cattle. That isn't the lie, at least it wasn't when. This is, has a uh, insulated jacket. We replaced it about three years ago because the old jacket was, was starting to leak and didn't have a lot of insulation. Um, also, we replaced it with a, um, a steel uh, bottom uh, because it, 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 it's, it's, it was more efficient. Uh, the copper bottom was starting to uh, corrode, um, and so we replaced it with a steel bottom. We waste less water, we waste, waste less energy. Words just to, to break each other's. The newer packages use less uh, cardboard and uh, there's no gloss, they're recycled better, and they're lighter weight, so they, the, packet, the shipping uh, in bulk when we, we buy them from the supplier, uh, transportation costs are reduced, and they're local, so it's a local design, local uh, source, um, local manufacturing. Well, Scott, it looks like you guys have made a bunch of really awesome changes around the brewery for your sustainability effort. Mm -hmm. What do you see going forward for Capital Brewery? What's next in the sustainability? It's an ongoing process. You, you, it's just like insulating an old home. You ne you're never done. You always got to you find a new crack or a new spot that you can add some insulation or, or adjust something to re reduce your consumption. Cheers! Cheers. Cheers. Score.